Phillies taking out the Nationals on Tuesday, picking up bottom two, one nothing Nats. Darren Ruff making his first major league start, digs in against Ross Detweiler. And he hits that one in the air to left field. On the run is Morse, out to the warning track, to the wall, gone! First major league hit is a home run for Darren Ruff. And he's just tied this ball game up in one apiece. And then, of course, the time-honored tradition of the silent treatment as Ruff gets to the dugout. Now, nearly five minutes have gone by. The silent treatment's still going. Ruff looks like he's getting a little worried. But as Jimmy Rollins pops out with two men aboard to end the frame, here comes the avalanche as Ruff is finally mobbed by his teammates. Maybe the best silent treatment we've seen all season. Ruff then getting the unsilent treatment from the Phillies fans. Bottom three still tied at one. It's two on it. Nobody out for Ryan Howard. He puts the Phils on top for the first time. RBI single to bring home John Mayberry. It's 2-1 Philadelphia. The very next batter for the Phils, Carlos Ruiz. In the air to left field. Boy, he crushed that one. Morse going back. It is gone. Three-run home run, Carlos Ruiz. And the Phillies have busted it open here in the third. It's a 5-1 ball game. Number 16 for Ruiz. Let's go top five, now 5-2. Cole Hamels on the hill facing Ryan Zimmerman as he delivers the two-out ribby single to score. Bryce Harper from second base as the Nats cut the deficit to a pair. It's 5-3. The two batters later, it's two on for Michael Morse, but Hamels gets him to ground it into the force out. Adam LaRoche gunned down at second. That ends the frame and ends Hamels' night. Five innings, seven hits, three earned, and he strikes out six. We go to the bottom of the sixth, the Phillies seeking some insurance, and there it is, high and deep to right, off the bat of Dominic Brown taking Craig Stammen yard. Philly goes back up by three, six to three, and that would be your final in this one, as Hamels picks up his career high 16th victory, despite failing to pitch six innings for just the third time in his last 30 starts. With the Braves walk-off victory on Tuesday against the Marlins, the Nationals' magic number to clinch the NL East remains at five.